Okay, so here we have Costa Candles, and I love this Frequently Asked Questions page because it's always this thing where I look at these things and I think, oh, that's a cool idea, and then I look a bit further and deeper into it, and I go, oh, I love this. It's a really cool idea. Um, and I sort of think, you know, how, you know, we can use this in other larger stores. Uh, Costa Candles is just a little business from what I can gather, just um, from what I can see online in terms of organic uh, traffic, but... I still think he's done a very clever idea with these videos. So what he's done is instead of just having, um, you know, frequently asked questions where he answers in text, he's created a video for each of these ones, uh, for each of these questions. And when I open them up in um, uh, YouTube, you know, again, they don't have a lot of traffic, but that's, you know, that'll come in time. Uh, but we can see here, you know, he's got a little bit of text here, but you know what's really cool? He actually appears on the screen and talks, and I don't know. Twenty seconds or so. He's doing. He's showing how. And then that way, it will truly. What to do if the wick doesn't catch light? You know, Uh, it just needs a little push to say it like that. And so you can see him as the store owner, the founder of this business, and he looks just, he's just gorgeous. He's got all the product in the background. Um, he's styled this beautifully. He speaks beautifully. And so I now have a genuine sort of warmth towards him and his brand. And so I instantly then wanted to go and have a look at more of his product. And I was like, wow, it's really, really cool stuff. It's quite masculine in the way it's done. So it's not just sort of um, a recent one I looked at was like, it was like maple syrup um, or popcorn candy kind of scents. And this, I look at this and um, he has wooden wicks that make this crackling noise. Um, and so I was like, wow, what a great differentiator. You know, popping candy is one differentiator for some people and crackling wicks is another differentiator or buying reason for other people. But I love this Easter statue. I just sort of thought, wow, that is so cool. It's it's strong. There's this strength and art. You know, there's this real class to his product. And so, again, I would never have known that unless I had watched a video where I got to see him uh, in his element, explaining his product. So here he is again. So this is obviously at a different time. Um, so it's not, I, I don't love this one, the style of it as well, because I can't see uh, his product, but I love I, how I can see all his product in the background through here and obviously his flat or wherever he might be. But I just thought this was a great idea. So if you can incorporate video into your frequently asked questions pages, it does increase dwell time because particularly if the video is played within the page. So Google will notice that people are staying on your page for a much longer amount of time. I would have probably added a little bit more text. I would have added some quotations out of the videos into here. Um, and I would probably have shown uh, his face at the very beginning of the video so that people can see they're really going to learn something from a real human because real humans are far more attractive and interesting than just text. So at first I thought, oh, this is just going to be text with a bit of background music. But when I saw him, I was like, oh, wow, that's so cool to see the founder, the owner, the actual crafter of this particular product. So um, yeah, I just want to encourage you all, if you can create um, a frequently asked questions page that has a few videos embedded in it. I think you'll find that it serves your customers much better. It creates a great content opportunity for you. Um, and I think it'll be more effective. Okay. Bye.